Okay, so the next video we're going to do is the mafaldine with shrimp, saffron, mint, and uh, sofrito. So there's a couple components to this dish. One of the components is a garlic breadcrumbs that get put over the top instead of like a cheese. Uh, so what we're going to need for that is panko breadcrumbs and garlic. Nice warm pan with olive oil. And we'll go ahead and get started. Just go ahead and add some whole garlic cloves to your, to your olive oil and heat it up. So basically you just want to get your oil warm with the garlic and start to make your olive oil fragrant with the, with the flavor of the garlic. And after this happens, after about 20 to 30 seconds or so, and you could do this in a big rondo. I'm doing it in a small pot because it's for the home kitchen. Then you go ahead and you add in your panko breadcrumbs. Take a wooden spoon. And just go ahead and work the breadcrumbs into the garlic oil. And you basically just mix and mix and mix, not taking your eyes off of it, until the panko breadcrumbs turn nice and golden brown. And that's essentially our garlic breadcrumbs. We'll revisit this in a few minutes once we have a nice golden brown just so you can see the color. So in your recipe I wrote butter instead of olive oil. You can use either one depending on if in the final dish you guys want to exclude most of the dairy or if you guys want to keep the dairy in. But this is kind of the golden brown you're looking for. With the garlic oil and the panko breadcrumbs. I just give them a little seasoning of sea, of sea salt. Basically, at this point, you're going to remove them from the pan and throw away your garlic. The next stage of the mafaldine prep is going to be the onion sofrito with saffron. So basically, you're going to get a pan hot with a good amount of olive oil. Go ahead and add in your yellow onions. And basically, just sweat them slowly. Turn your heat way down. Sweat them really slowly for about 20 minutes until they get very soft. I'm doing a very small amount, so it's not going to be 20 minutes. But um, we will get them very, very soft for the final dish. About half, about after your onions have turned soft, you're going to go ahead and add your saffron. We'll come back after I add the saffron. Okay, I've added the saffron and the onions are super soft now. That's what you're going to look at, very bright yellow color. Basically, your sofrito is done at this point. Just going to take it off and cool it down for the final dish. Okay, now for the mafaldine, we have all the components ready to go. Um, we're going to go ahead and start making the sauce to order. When your order comes in, your pasta is cooking in the boiler. And then you're going to start the sauce. So we go ahead and we lay in to a hot saute pan. Lay in our shrimps. I like to get a little sear on the shrimp. Again, I'm making a portion for about three people. This is not for, for one person, so please keep that in mind. shrimp is in the pan, just let it sit and get a nice sear. Don't, don't mess with it too much. Okay, so when your shrimp is almost browned a little bit, you're going to go ahead and add your chopped garlic or sliced garlic. I'm just going to jiggle the pan a little bit so that the garlic kind of falls in between the shrimp. Okay, at this point you're going to go ahead and add in your sofrito and some pasta water and a little bit of chili flake.
basically doing this just to stop the cooking process to make sure the garlic doesn't burn and the frogs don't overcook. Alright, at this point our pasta is done cooking. I'm going to go ahead and move it right over to the sauce. So you're going to notice the saffron is going to give pasta a very beautiful yellow color. And the, the sofrito is going to coat the noodles. And the shrimp, just cook it together for about 20 to 30 seconds. Then we're going to remove it from the heat. Okay, we're going to remove it from the heat. We add a little bit of fresh olive oil. We're going to go ahead and add our lemon zest. Toss it all together. and we're going to plate up. And on the top of this pasta, we're going to go ahead and add your garlic breadcrumbs instead of cheese and micro mint if you have it. This is your mafaldine with saffron, mint, lemon, and garlic breadcrumbs and shrimp. Enjoy.